I'd like to do a series um, that focuses on the Epistle to the Romans by Karl Barth. I think it's not well represented on YouTube and provides a lot of thought-provoking material for Christians and non-Christians alike to think about. So I'll start at the beginning <clears throat> and read a passage. Paul is authorized to deliver the gospel of God. He is commissioned to hand over to men something quite new and unprecedented, joyful and good, the truth of God. Yes, precisely of God. The gospel is not a religious message to inform mankind of their divinity or to tell them how they may become divine. The gospel proclaims a God utterly distinct from men. Salvation comes to them from him because they are as men incapable of knowing him. And because they have no right to claim anything from him, the gospel is not one thing in the midst of other things to be directly apprehended and comprehended. The gospel is the word of the primal origin of all things, the word which, since it was ever new, must ever be received with renewed fear and trembling. The gospel is therefore not an event, nor an experience, nor an emotion, however delicate. Rather, it is clear and objective perception of what eye hath not seen, nor ear heard. Moreover, what it demands of men is more than notice, or understanding, or sympathy. It demands participation, comprehension, cooperation, for it is a communication with presumes faith in the living God, and which creates that which it presumes.